know, NFC or near field communication is one of the buzzwords in the mobile phone industry at the moment. And what it is, is the ability to send small bits of data from a handset to a machine that's able to read that information and interpret that information. Now, one application of this is the uh, transferring of money or payment, in fact. And Visa has teamed up with Samsung. And on this Samsung Galaxy S2, there's a Visa application that will allow you to make payments uh, when you're at a till in a shop, for example, much like you can with contactless card payments. Uh, there are two types of payment. There's a small transaction and a large transa transaction. In the UK, anything below 20 pounds is considered a small transaction and you can do that offline. So now anything over 20 pounds is considered a high value transaction and that will, that will require authorization from your bank, so it will need to be an online transaction. But NFC isn't all about making payments and transferring money. As we see here at the Sony booth, where they're demonstrating some of the NFC capabilities of their Sony Xperia S mobile phone. So with these four tags, which you get supplied with the device, you're able to program the phone to access certain applications when you touch them against it. So, for example, this red one has been programmed to activate the music application. So you just touch it there. You can see it's switched on the Bluetooth speakers, which are just over there. Uh, the blue one, for example, will access the running applications. So that might be when you're leaving the house and you want to track your progress, your distance that you've run and the time that you've been running for. And these tags can be programmed to access up to 10 applications each and to control which ones you do access with them, you just touch here and you can change the names and see which applications they launch. Like I say, up to 10 each. Now, if more than one person had this smartphone, then these tags could access different applications on each handset within the house. So you could leave them around your house, leave one in the car, one by the front door, and access those features just through touch. So NFC enabled handsets look like they're gonna be coming to the UK in numbers. Uh, there are several on show here at Mobile World Congress. So we can expect to see more applications introduced as people begin to adopt the technology. And for more information on NFC and for different mobile phone reviews, go to our website at witch.co.uk.